All right, guys, uh, we have a new project. This is what we have. Uh, the fuel pump went out. Watch a lot of videos, but I'm not gonna bore you with a bunch of stuff. So this is the new, new parts. So I'm gonna walk you through it, and that should be a piece of cake. So this is what we have. On them, 5500, the pump, it's underneath. All right, here we go. Let's put this over here. Water pump, I mean, fuel pump is working. Seems to be working, but there's no gas coming out. So that means it's it's pretty bad, and it's just die. Oh, there you go. Now it's working. Well, once I have the pump loose, seems to be working, so, but I'm gonna replace it anyway. So first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna disconnect this hose so I can have access so that we can hold down. Now these connections, you don't have to worry about because one is a male and one is a female, so there is no confusion there. And once again, to test it, you just have to go press down. And see, you can hear it's working fine. But as, like I mentioned before, it's it's loose on uh, uh, down here, so I don't know if that can help a little bit. But I'm gonna replace it anyway. I don't know. I might just replace it. I got the new one. So let's see. Well, after replacing the fuel pump, the filter, and the entire gas line, as you can see, under, you have to put some seat types. We're gonna make sure. Can you hear that noise? That's the new fuel pump. 